What is going on guys? My name is Cam and we are back at it again with another thrifting episode. I actually wasn't even supposed to go to the store today, but I was coming home from an errand and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna stop at this store. So this store specifically, I haven't been to in quite a while. It's definitely been probably three weeks. So I figured why not hit it? It was like five minutes from my house. So I decided just to go there. If you guys see anything you like in the video, there's a link in the description down below and you can click that and that will be my eBay store. Everything I find will be posted on there. And I'm actually gonna tell you guys, today we found some of the most amazing pieces ever. Like we even found some Jordans, stay tuned. Alright guys, we have made it to the first location of the day. I haven't missed this Google in like two weeks now, so let's see what we can go ahead and find. So guys, first find of the day. This brand's usually not that good. It is Nordstrom, but it's made in Italy, which is a very very expensive piece of so four bucks I think this slips into like 30 bucks so we're gonna go ahead and pick it up it's pretty basic nothing nothing too you know cool about it but yeah and the next piece we got on this rack we have a champion echo hoodie seems like it's new but there is no price tag on this so I'm not sure how much this would be but we're gonna go ahead and see what it's worth and see if we can pick it up and what do we have here guys this is a good piece right here we got a Pendleton long sleeve button down dress shirt. So this is gonna retail for a good amount and they only want four bucks. So we're definitely taking this. Guys, we found some heat. Nike Pro Combat jacket with new with tags. And also what's cool is behind this, look at this guys. Boom, full zip Nike. For $10 they are kind of taxing, but it's a size 2X. So we're still gonna pick them up really two solid pieces oh man oh man so far this store has been great we already picked up like six things all in the car right here and i wasn't even gonna come here so crazy guys like i said a new rack just came out so we're gonna go ahead and give it a check and see what we can find So we didn't find nothing in that rack, but not all new racks can be good, but hey, it's worth it to check. So I found another Nike middle check right here. It's not vintage, this is year to date, so, but it is a nice shirt. And of course, like I said about middle swoosh, it does better. For $7, we're gonna pick this up. Next thing we got is a pair of Nike big swoosh on the front shorts. So, but they are asking like nine bucks for these. Let me see. Yeah, nine dollars for these, so maybe I'll take it, I don't know yet. This is also a good find right here, but look at this price, $9. And it has like a little bleach stain right here, so yeah, unfortunately that's gonna be staying behind. However, right next to that one, we have a pair of Jordan like sweatpants. These are really, really nice quality with the logo here and a zip pocket, so and I think it's pretty reasonable. Yeah, $7, that's, that's fair. There is a slight stain like down here, so I'm gonna see if I can get that out, but hey. You know, that's that's a good pickup. This is why you guys always look at the tag of the clothing. Take a look at this. These just look like basic black sweatpants, right? But actually, if you look at this tag, it says Gore-Tex. And, you know, looking more into it, I couldn't find, like, the brand brand of it. Because Gore-Tex is usually, like, a collaboration type thing. But if you look on the back of this, it's actually made in the USA. So for $4, these are going to flip maybe for, like, 30 And look how basic they are. Crazy. Take a look at all three of these pieces we just got. We have a Ralph Lauren, like, I guess, bathrobe. <laughs> Normally, I wouldn't pick something up, but it is Ralph Lauren, so pretty cool. Once again, we have another Ralph Lauren piece here, all over print with the pony, um, size large, and they're asking $6 for those, and they resell for around like 20 so easy flip. And take a look at this piece Nike NBA Chicago Bulls windy city on the front like this is so nice and look at the price nine bucks for that that's that is that is some heat 
All right, that looks like it's for the clothing. Let's go check the shoes. Last time I found Kobe's in here, so let's see if we can do that again. I'm, this would be insane if I call it. As soon as I pull up in the aisle, we got some J's right away. This, that is insane. This store always hits with shoes. Like, I don't know what it is. <laughs> I can't even express to you guys how much we just made in just three pairs of shoes. Go ahead and take a look at what I just found. Gamma Blue 12, crazy. They're a little beat up, but I'm gonna fix them up, but damn and look how much nine dollars on top of that we also found these like nike shocks right here these are like 60 bucks and they're asking like eight bucks for them and then we also have these down here which are like marrow and i think they're like hiking shoes i'm not sure but they're going for like 50 and they're only asking 10 bucks so that's just crazy i just cannot believe i just found these oh damn that was pretty Pretty unexpected, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and check the hard goods. Maybe we can come up as big as the shoes, but we will see. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what we can find and flip for a profit. Not a bad find right here. We have the Xbox Connect for five bucks. Easy 20 bucks. Hopefully it works. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and head out of this store. I think it's gonna be my only store today. But out of everything, we, we found some crazy stuff in this one store. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and check out and I'll catch you guys outside. Oh my gosh. Guys, what did we just find? Oh, I'm actually so much in shock right now. This is actually insane. Guys, from this one store, like definitely over $500. I only spent $120. Oh my god, guys, what in the world just happened in this store? Guys, I just found Jordan 12 Gamma Blues. Like, what? What? For $9? What? I got so many bags. Like, I wasn't going to come here today, and I'm literally not thrifting today. This is like the only store I was like, you know what? I'm passing by it. I'm going to go ahead and stop on in it because... Why not? If you guys are enjoying the video, please leave a subscribe and a like down below. I appreciate it. And of course, if you see anything you like in the video, hit the link in the description down below. And that is my store. Thank you guys so much for all the support. I can't believe what we just found. Guys, take a look at what my boy Ace just found. Ace said, what's good? What's good, yo? Look at all this sealed in the box at an <laughs> estate sale, right? Yep. That's wow. crazy. See guys, you guys never know what you can find. All you gotta do is wake up early and you guys just go thrifting, go estate selling and wow. This is why I tell you guys, just go thrifting. Just go, just go whenever you want. Just be like, hey, I'm gonna go stop in this thrift store and see what they got. And look what I did. Guys, I can't believe I found these. Like, I, I can't believe this. I, I seriously can't believe this. These are. These are like over $200, like what? On top of all that, we obviously got our bags here. We got roughly like five, six bags in there and that bag as well. We spent like 120 for everything. And of course, these right here are just gonna return us all of our money plus some. And then that means everything else is just profit. We made it back in the studio, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video so much. I definitely was astonished by what I found today. It's absolutely insane. I can't believe we found those Jordans. If you guys did enjoy the video, please subscribe and leave a like down below. It'll help me out so much. I appreciate all the love and support from you guys. And of course, guys, usually when you go to a thrift store, you don't find a lot of good stuff like this, but occasionally you do. Just for some reason, for the past two weeks, I've been hitting at every single store I've been at. But thank you guys for all the support and I will catch you guys in the next video.